Hi everyone, in this tutorial I'm just going to show you how to use Crocodoc, which is a tool within Canvas that allows you to annotate uh, documents that are submitted to you um, as an instructor or for peer review. So I'm going into this resume assignment here, and I'll go into SpeedGrader, and I think I have a submission from a student. And I do. So the document usually shows up here, and this is a resume assignment. So first I could fill out my rubric, and the qualifications, education, references are all there, so I'll save my rubric. Then what I can do is actually annotate this. So I can um, put in comments in specific areas, and I can say, is this Batman? And I can put those in basically anywhere I want. And over here, I'm asking if it's spelled correctly there, and it obviously is, so if I don't like that, all I need to do is just mouse over it and hit delete, and that'll get rid of that comment. What I can also do is draw all over this thing, so if I want to draw an arrow to a word or underline a word, another word or something like that, I can do that, or even if I want to circle um, a word, I can do that. Um, so another thing I can do is highlight some text. I can highlight that text, it looks like, and we'll make it orange. There we go. Um, I can strike out things, so if they need to remove a couple of words, I can do that. There it is. And if I want to remove any of these, some of those I can move around like this. If it's a drawing, I can right-click them to remove the drawing. I can right-click them to remove the highlights, all sorts of stuff. I can even add comments to highlights if I want to. So this is a highlight. So this is a really good tool to be able to mark up documents, whether you're grading as an instructor or engaging in a peer review for your classmates. Um, right now, this supports PDF formats, um, document formats, Word docs, and uh, PowerPoints, but it doesn't support um, Excel documents at this time, and it doesn't even support pictures. So right now, we're just looking at documents, but it's a very, very useful tool. Then when your peers come in, when your students come in, they'll be able to see these annotations, and they can even comment back as well if they like. Okay, so that's how you use Crocodoc to annotate documents.